Hello and a very warm welcome back to episode 16 of the Valley of the Old Farm with me, Wasteland Gaming. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the Valley of the Old Farm and the vintage farming series. We've got baling to do today, lots of baling. So um, I've got um, most of the equipment down at our little grass field next to the grapes here um, and yeah we've got quite a few bales still to make up so we've got a bit of windrowing and a little bit of um, baling to do and then collecting obviously now I've cut all the straggly bits down here and then yeah all the grass down here and we've then um, put the windrow um, tether over it and made hay so it's just drying in the sun and going to get the rest of it tethered. I've done the wind, uh, the headlands of this field and bailed that up so everyone's looking okay but we've also done a contract as well so I can't remember whether I mentioned it on the last episode but over here the field 26 which we actually did as a silage contract last year um, we've done for hay as well and there's 17 bales to collect off that one as well. Now been using the Fiat Agri for this, for the baler, which is pulling it brilliantly. Um, been using the Deutzfar for the windrowing, and then I've been using the Zetor for the tedding. And what I did is I sold our little far tedder and I bought this class one instead, which is slightly bigger working width and um, yeah, worked really well actually. Quite happy with that. Um, so what we need to do. We need to jump in the doits. I'm going to windrow up the rest of this. <coughs> Excuse me. And um, yeah, let's get this. Uh, let's get this all done, shall we? So yeah, hope everyone's well. Um, I'm recording this episode and the last episode back to back, um, just because I've got a little bit of time. Um, recording this nice and early in the morning. Um, so. Yeah, hopefully the sound quality is okay. I know I had a few issues with my microphone um, the other day. Um, just recently had my birthday, so I might invest with a bit of my birthday cash into treat myself to a new headset, maybe. Because um, yeah, this one's done me well for the last couple of years, but um, yeah, it's starting to look a little bit tired and tatty and the connections are a little bit funny. I had toyed with the idea of potentially getting um, one of those uh, actual just mics as well but not sure which would be better. Probably a mic would be better for PC wouldn't it but since I play on console mainly probably a headset's better. So what we also need to do this episode is get some fertilizer onto the um, olives and onto the grapes as well. Um, they're in need of their next stage of fertilization because they've all gone on a growth stage. So it kind of makes sense to do that. And the last thing we need to do is um, get ourselves some milk down to the dairy. So I'm going to rest overnight before we do that because that will just give us a bit of extra milk in the morning. Um, so the priority really now is to get the this, this field windrowed and baled and uh, all the bales collected up and complete that contract. So uh, relatively small windrows this but to be honest it, it works. It's just more ups and downs isn't it at the end of the day. Should have collected these bales up before I uh, embarked on this shouldn't I? Never mind.
Okay, last little bit of windrowing to do then. Little smidges here, and then let's get the baler out. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to run this back up the field, up up to the farm here, because what I need to do is get the um, front loader attached, and we'll get um, a bale fork on of some sort, or hay fork, something like that, so I can pick up these bales. Right, this can go in the back of here. Terrible reversing. Okay. Oh dear. Nice and slowly, there we go. Then we get our front loader here. Okay, and Pop the bucket out for. Well, I need a weight. Alright, I'll put the bucket here. And then. The hay forks in here, isn't it? Here. There we go. Grab that. Perfect. Right. Let's get down to business. So I think we'll shift these uh, these bales out of the way first, and then once they're out of the way, then we can uh, can concentrate on uh, the rest of the bales. Get these two on first. Now, obviously, um, our other little bale trailer thing is um, not available just now because it's got apples all over it. But um, not to worry. Right, we'll get this other bale here. Shouldn't really be driving over the sunflowers, but not to worry. And get this one here. Right, let's get these on as well. Sorry, the camera angles are all funny today. Right, there's four. 
So I think what I'll do is I'll get the rest of these bales on and then we'll get some baling done as well and we'll put that as a bit of a time lapse and uh, next time you see us we'll have this field cleared and um, hopefully yeah, we'll be on to the contracting field and get them uh, out of the way as well. Right, we're pretty much getting there. We've got 16 bales here and a, a couple more left on the field. Um, we're going to get these into our bale storage um, and leave them in there for now. But um, yeah, fairly happy with the stacking on this trailer. It's pretty neat. 
Will it go under here, hopefully? Just about, yeah. That's fine. Right. So, I think we'll go into this far away one. in here. There we go. So what have we got in here now? So 29 bales, uh, straw, alfalfa and hay. Nice. And then in this one, seven silage bales. So in fact, yeah, we will obviously make some more silage. The other grass field we own, we will make into grass um, into grass silage, and um, we'll use that for the cows, um, and that should keep us going actually um, for now. Uh, we've still got a silage bale and a hay bale here, which we can use for um, for feed for the next next game day, I guess. Um, and then, yeah, hopefully everyone else will be fine after that. Right, I'm going to collect the rest of these bales. I'm going to finish the contract, uh, the baling contract. We'll get them bales delivered. As you can see, we've got three left on here. And then, um, yeah, we'll rest overnight. And uh, we'll see you in the morning. Well, that was annoying. I thought... <laughs> Uh, I'd hit record, I was just yakking away to myself and realised it didn't record. <laughs> so, <laughs> the milk is now down at the dairy. Um, if we go into the productions, <laughs> um, I've set the mil uh, the butter to distributing. Um, so that's in there. So it's all processing just now. Um, and in fact, what I'm going to do is I'll turn the chocolate off just now. So the chocolate we can just sell. It doesn't need to go in the cakes. Um, so we'll we'll make some money out of that at some point, but what we're going to do is concentrate on the butter, get that distributed, and then we can start making our cakes because um, we've got flour in there, uh, we've got sugar, we've got eggs, we've got apples, we have melon, um, we have strawberries. So really, we just mil need milk and butter in there, um, and that's going to give us uh, cake. So. Yeah, we will keep letting these uh, cows produce milk, and then hopefully, yeah, before long we'll have cake on the go as well. So I think, um, oh, keep doing that with that. Must press the wrong button. So we've got a thousand liters of milk there again. Um, and uh, that will do the job. So, as I mentioned before, we're going to nip along here and uh, get... Oh, you wouldn't have heard that. So, I'm going to get this... Um, the oat field fertilised. I'm not going to do the grapes, as I mentioned at the start of the episode, because what I'm going to do is uh, I want to get... is I want to get this this field done and then next episode hopefully or next game day we can get the sunflowers done and then what I will do is I'll get the grapes and the olives done maybe off screen um, and get them fertilised and then once the sunflowers are done uh, that should be everything fully fertilised in theory Tractors in need of a clean. So let's get this over to the field and uh, hopefully it's all good. Left the weeder over here because those sunflowers will need weeding at some point as well. Right, that appears to be working. I'll just double check. Where are we? Down here. Yep, 
Yep, so that's for Isaac now, which is good. And uh, yeah, I'll just mosey on up and down this field and get this done. So I think we'll finish the episode there. I'll have a bit of a tidy up. I've still got all the baling stuff down there as well. We'll maybe spray the grass field. Mm. Uh, yeah, I know I will. I might get another cut off it before I have to uh, plough it all up and I'm going to put canola in it. So I uh, made a decision to put canola in it. So we might get another cut off it before I have to plough it up and uh, replant it. So what we'll do, we'll maybe hold off on the hold off on the ploughing, um, and then that means, yeah, well, potentially get another 17 bales off it, which should be good. Um, so I think it sounds a sensible decision. Um, either make maybe probably make silage bales next time round. And then, yeah, we'll be uh, in a good place for the winter then. Uh, and then, yeah, once August comes round, then we can get it ploughed in and turned into a canola field. So, I'm going to have to refill this uh, this sprayer at some point, but that's fine. Okay. So, I'll leave you all to it. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you have done, don't forget to hit that like button. If you want to subscribe to the channel, please do. Uh, if you want to share a comment, you're more than welcome to. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. But, big shout out to everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Um, Channel's doing really well at the moment, so thank you very much. Please, please, please do comment though. Uh, any comments, I do obviously get back to you as soon as I can. Um, there's one thing I'd like to do is have more engagement with uh, the folk that do watch these videos. So if you do want to throw us a comment, even if it's just to say hello, I'll get back to you. Don't be shy. <laughs> but in the meantime, from Vintage Farming and the Valley Old Farm. Take care and we'll see you all again soon. Bye bye.